Some sort of nodule in here. Are you finding any? A little bit of uh, nodules and stuff. through. Oh, look at that. <coughs> That's the piece we were digging out originally. And it ended up, it looks like it ends up getting bigger back in there. that I'm seeing is at least a, probably about a silver dollar size around. And there's more right here, right under it. Looking good. Might actually be able to get something out of there. You can see, found a pocket of this agate, druzy. You can see there's different flow zones, but yeah, I mean just big old chunks of I get going through it. We could get down here in the hole. type stuff. It has a little bit of druzy quartz on top of it. Oh yeah, look at that. Very small. It's very, uh, a ton of iron around it. So it's, uh, kind of weathered. Good seeds. Broken up. There's tons of little, it's like broken up quartz inside of it. Just little, little mineralized geode kind of type things. Right. Yep, that's a nice little chalcedony agate nodule. Pocket right there. See that little hole we're digging here. And this uh, 
exposure of basalt. And there's all these little uh, chlorite kind of pockets to it. So we got that exposed. Another one right here. There's another vein that runs right here parallel with it. Anyways, pretty cool. That one's nice and intact. So you can see right there, we got some quartz crystallization going on on the other side. But if you want to hold that and I'm going to try this out because it sounds really good. Oh wow, look at that nodule. Look how clear that is. Setting that off to the side, that's cool. All types of little tiny nodules of uh, some sort of chloratized silica. And I didn't crack this. I did. You can see it's chipped. Hopefully there's still a good portion that's left in the hole. Just trying to clear it without, without breaking that. Looks like there's, there's something there too. As you can see, it's occurring in uh, a basalt, if you want to zoom in. You can see that it's a basalt, a weathered basalt. It's definitely coarse on the outside. It probably has more crystal growth going on. It looks like it's starting to move. I don't want to apply too much pressure and then can slip it off and bang the piece we're trying to get out. So it's going to take your time. Kind of like a thunder egg. Feels like that's part of it. Got a little, a little piece of something similar right next to it. A little bit of crystal growth to it. You can see it, the whole thing's wiggling. Coming apart into more pieces. Oh, it's fractured. Some really nice water clear quartz crystals in there, but they're all fractured. Would have been a really cool geo. That's correct. Okay, it seems like this all 
might come in one piece and it actually looks like it has a little bit of pink to it almost like a just like I am at this time Got some amethyst here. Huh? Got some amethyst here. A little bit. Camera will pick that up. Very slightly pink on the very tips of it. Tons of iron stain. I wouldn't be surprised there's more of that kind of pinkish purple kind of amethyst type stuff deeper in here. Go up here to this knob because I think we're getting ready to leave. So I'm at least get this one out. Looks like there's kind of a carnelian effect going on. Some of, some of the seams. It's a nice nodule right there, a little one. Nice little, pretty good size notch. to it. 